After the last few years of limited options, the United Way Halton and Hamilton is thrilled to be able to host its full spectrum of fundraising events this summer. Right now, we're over at Glen Abbey Golf Course, and it's our first kind of public event of the, of the campaign. Sold out. It's a great kickstart and getting some momentum behind the campaign. We have a number of different events, including an event which used to happen, but because of COVID and ended up going into the ether, is back. It's the big plane pull that's coming in September. I'm really looking forward to that. Been working out. There's a number of different events uh, that we'll be able to both leverage what we've learned working virtually and getting people enthused and, and energized around the campaign, but also being in person. Right now in the community, people are struggling. We know that people are challenged to meet their everyday needs, to meet their bills, to pay their rent, to pay their heat, to pay their hydro or their mortgages. And with the talks of a looming recession in sight, people are worried about what that looks like in the future. So the needs are always growing. United Way is deeply involved in the community. And even though they're quite a large organization, what they do best is get inside the community and fund those programs that really get the help directly to the folks that, that need it. You know, they support over 57 different organizations. There's 106 different programs that they support. Many years ago, Ken Small found himself needing that support. I needed the United Way when uh, I was a single father and I had uh, two young, a three-month-old and a toddler. And uh, there were times where things were really, really tight. And if it hadn't been for a lot of the agencies funded by the United Way, um, yeah, I really don't know where I would have been. Now he's working at the Oakville Ford plant and canvassing for the United Way as a volunteer. It was kind of full circle because when I saw a lot of the agencies that were uh, being helped, I remembered, oh, okay, yeah, I remember coming here when I was in need, not realizing at the time that it was actually funded by the United Way. Right? So yeah, I try to get out there, I try to spread the word, let everybody know right, that um, you know, every dollar that helps, helps. And this year, fundraisers like the golf tournament are more crucial than ever before. So while we always say the need is growing and increasing, this is going to be a year where we're really going to feel it. We're already hearing talks from not-for-profits that it's getting tougher and tougher for them to pay their bills, for them to keep their doors open, and United Way is going to be the backdrop that's here to support them. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.